Hey everyone, welcome back to another Storefront UI tutorial. Today we have core, View Storefront core team member with us, Jacob. Uh, and we're actually going to be circling back on a topic we covered in our first video, which is adding Storefront UI to a Nuxt project. And in this, with this new Nuxt project that Jacob has created, uh, adding Storefront UI to your Nuxt project becomes much simpler and there's a lot less uh, hunting around for where to add lines and making sure you got everything all, uh, set up correctly. So Jacob, show us what you got. Okay, so uh, we will start with the fact that we recently released a Storefront UI module for Nuxt. So now, when you create a Nuxt, Nuxt.js project, uh, instead of uh, downloading the Storefront UI slash view package, what we will do, we will just install Storefront UI slash Nuxt package. And what will happen right now is we will in the next config.js file, we would not have to add global CSS for Storefront UI, and you won't have to include the transpile rule for the Storefront mm -hmm. UI. We will just have to add this line here. So include a Storefront UI next module. And what will happen now is that we'll have exactly the same functionality that we had before, but with less lines of code and much simpler configuration. So as you can see right now, when we reload the page and the then the server was reloaded, we still have the same functionality of the page with awesome. less lines of code. Which is always great to reduce lines of code. You gotta save on those page load times, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> um, so to get this Nux project, uh, we're gonna be leaving a link down in the description uh, to just go take a quick look at it at the NPM, uh, what is this, like the community. And if you also want to learn more about what Nuxt modules are, we're going to be leaving a link to the Nuxt documentation just to see exactly how they work with your Nuxt project. And finally, as always, if you have any more questions about Storefront UI and things you want to learn about, uh, we'll also link our GitHub RFC in the description. Uh, where you can leave any ideas or questions you have, and we'll get to making a video about them as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video.